After several years of civil war, South Sudan became the 193rd member of the United Nations in July 2011. However, the country is in ruin. Ravaged by fighting, especially in the north of the country, South Sudan lacks road infrastructure. With only 300 kilometers of road in a country larger than Spain, this remains a major stumbling block to economic development. The UN mission in South Sudan, UNMIS, wants to reconstruct the road leading to the capital Juba, a stretch of 2.5 kilometers, which will help residents get back on track. Everyone uses this road, even the vice president. But there are many accidents and the dust that people inhale along the road is also causing health problems among residents and pedestrians. The government should step in and repair our roads. When it was not on construction like this, we faced many problems. There are a lot of bombs, a lot of calls, uh, erosion carried out by water. So we faced a lot of problems while riding. So at the moment where they have started like this, we are a bit feel they okay. But the most thing we would like the money, the unimis to do and the government is we like the road to be tamar. This work is only the start of the journey for the South Sudanese government. Last year they stopped oil production following a disagreement with the North. It's only recently that an agreement has been found to restart production. Oil contributes to 98% of the South Sudanese government's budget, while the government has said they'll build 7,000 kilometers of road over the next 10 years.